hold it.
Guy, you want some camera time? She looks good in your camera. You say hi. You're gonna be shy today? I don't blame you. Good as new. Ish. Well, that ain't even gonna reach. Goodness. Hmm. I'm trying a long one. Why are you still recording me? It's a little sketchy. I'm doing a bit okay. All right, let's go to the next one. It needs to come pull it out. Okay. Bingo.
talk about what we're doing here. So we're bringing about 20 or so uh, first time heifers, first calf. And uh, most of them are pretty well mannered, but they haven't had real close contact with people. And uh, so we set this pin up. I can bring them in right here through this gate. And uh, we can hold them in this little area here. And we've got this division in the middle with the gate. So while they're in here, and they'll only be here for about three or four days, maybe five. And we do that to have them in a tight spot. Because after you move them, you know, they're going to get rounded up, work through the chute, then they're going to get moved about 10 miles down the road. And so that's a little stressful. It kind of weirds them out. So if you just turn them loose into a wide open pasture, they start running and uh, they can run through your fences if you don't have very good fences. And it's, it's pretty warm out, so I don't want to stress them out too much. And like I said, they're, they are bred heifers, so they are carrying calves in them and that just adds another another level of risk to everything so anyway we put them in this tight pen and uh, keep them in here three four days maybe five just kind of depends on how they act but i got this division fence in here so when i want to feed them or i need to fill up their water trough and i need to bring a tractor into the side i'm standing in i can push them into this end close the gate and then I can open this gate back here and be able to come in here and drop a bale of hay or silage or a water tote or whatever it is that I need. So that's the setup. Next Monday, we're gonna bring them down here and uh, we'll take everybody along for the ride there too. Fortunately for this, this part of the project's over. So that's probably gonna be it for now.